Hi, I'm Rachel Reynolds, one of the dietitians at the Sergeant Choice Nutrition Center, and today I'm gonna to be making a super easy chicken recipe. It's baked chicken nuggets, so an easy version of a favorite. First, I'm gonna start with cutting the chicken. So here, you can see on some of the chicken pieces, there's a little bit of fat here, so we wanna cut that off, because if you get that in your nugget, you're gonna end up with a little bit of a chewy spot, and nobody wants that. I wanna to try to have as uniform sized pieces as I can, so I'm actually gonna cut off the little tail down here on the chicken just so I have sort of like a nice rectangle for my chicken here. I'm gonna try to cut in about one and a half inch pieces. It doesn't have to be perfect, just so all those chicken nuggets will cook at about the same time. Next thing we're gonna do is make an egg wash for the chicken. So we're gonna take our eggs, put them into the bowl here. And now we're gonna whisk the eggs. We just wanna make sure we incorporate the whites and the yolks as much as we possibly can. You can also just use a fork, just like you are scrambling eggs. All right, next thing we're gonna do is take our Parmesan cheese and put it right in with the breadcrumbs. You can actually just mix that up a little bit with your hands, it doesn't have to be perfect. So next thing I'm gonna do is start to take the chicken, we're gonna dredge it in the egg wash. You really wanna kinda push it in there and get as many breadcrumbs as you can to get a nice coating on each piece of chicken. I'm gonna put it on my cookie sheet over here, which I've actually covered with tin foil. It's a nice trick just to make for less cleanup, and I've sprayed it with some cooking spray, which helps to keep the chicken nuggets from sticking. So I've used whole wheat breadcrumbs today, and the reason for that is that it is a little bit healthier, so yes, we are gonna have a little bit more fiber, a little bit more nutrition with the whole wheat breadcrumbs, but also they stick a little bit better to the nuggets, and they also help to make a more crispy breading than regular breadcrumbs do. If you have regular breadcrumbs at home or panko breadcrumbs, you can use those as well, but the whole wheat breadcrumbs really work nicely for these nuggets. We're gonna put it in a 400 degree oven for 20 minutes. I'm actually gonna set my timer for 10 minutes because halfway through, we're gonna flip them so they get that nice crisp breading on both sides. So while the nuggets are cooking, now we're gonna make a couple of dipping sauces. We're gonna start first with something super easy. It's honey mustard sauce. I have a cup of plain non-fat yogurt, a half a cup of honey. A nice trick when you're making something that includes something sticky, like a honey or a peanut butter, is to actually spray your measuring cup or your measuring spoon with your cooking spray first. Next, we're gonna do a quarter cup of the Dijon mustard and then we're just gonna mix it up, super easy. So now we're gonna move on to a healthier take um, on a blue cheese dipping sauce. We have one cup of the non-fat plain yogurt once again. We're gonna put in about a half a cup of blue cheese crumbles, then just a teaspoon of a white vinegar just to give a little bit of a, a zing. Mix it up. And now our dipping sauces are ready to go. All right, so our chicken nuggets are done. I'm just gonna take them out of the oven. Put a couple on the plate here. And then put both sauces on the plate, just the blue cheese, and a little bit of honey mustard. All right, so now our chicken nuggets are done. We have our two sauces and we're ready to enjoy. It's a really easy weeknight recipe, very basic, low prep. Hope that you enjoy.